first starting up your ACE system, it's important to understand the makeup of your fill water. Talk to your hot spring dealer to understand if the water in your area has high levels of calcium hardness or metal content. If you do have high levels of calcium hardness or metals in your water, you'll need to adjust them before getting started. You can use a test strip or bring in a water sample to your hot spring dealer before your hot tub is delivered to better understand the makeup of your fill water. We suggest filling your spa with the on-the-go portable water softener to ensure you get started with the best water possible. Once your hot tub is filled, you can get started with the ACE system. Step one is to test your spa water using a freshwater five-way test strip. It's important that you use the freshwater brand of test strips to ensure that you are adjusting your water into the okay ranges that are safe for the ACE system. Use the test strip to measure pH, alkalinity, and hardness. Follow the instructions on the bottle to adjust your pH and alkalinity into the okay ranges. The next step is to adjust your calcium hardness. If the calcium level of your water is above 75 parts per million, you'll want to use the Vanishing Act Calcium Remover to decrease the calcium hardness into the okay range. The target is 50 parts per million. Keeping the calcium hardness low is especially important to getting the most out of your ACE cell. You can continue the ACE startup process while the Vanishing Act works. Now that your water is balanced, you can add the salt. Refer to the label on the bottle of salt that was included with your ACE system. The target level of salt is 1,750 parts per million. You want to add the salt one cup at a time with the jets running and allow about five minutes for the salt to dissolve. Use the salt test strips that came with your ACE system to verify that the salt level is in the OK range. Now it's time to set your output level and tell the ACE system about how much chlorine and other cleaners you need the system to generate. Access the ACE water care menu on your spa's control panel to select your output level. We suggest starting with an initial output level of between three and five, depending on your spa size. The final step is to add granular dichlor, or lithium chloride, to the spa. We call this an initial shock, and it helps the ACE system get started cleaning the contaminants in your fill water or in your spa's plumbing. It will take about 24 hours for the ACE system to clean your fill water and start producing a measurable amount of chlorine. You may continue to see the green light on the front of your hot tub flashing until your water is above 95 degrees. When you come back to the spa about 24 hours later, dip a test strip to ensure that the pH and alkalinity are within the okay ranges and make sure the hardness of the water is now between 25 and 75 parts per million. If at this point you still don't have a chlorine reading on your test strip, that's okay. It means that the ACE system is still at work cleaning the spa water. Getting the startup process right for the ACE system is important toward ensuring that you have the absolute best hot water experience. If you have any questions along the way, be sure to refer to the quick reference guide that came with your ACE system or contact your hot spring dealer.